The way your body looks, the way that you feel, the way that you perform is simply the outcome of your habits, actions, and choices. We have big goals for 2018. I'm proud of you. I want you to anchor those goals on reality. If you want a six pack, if you want more muscles, if you want to get lean, if you want to get shredded, if you want to get big, you must change these things. No change happens without consistency. It's what you can consistently do that's going to change your outcome. What can you realistically be committed to? If you don't have the means or the mindset or the time to change a habit or an action or a choice to determine a different outcome, you can't complain about it. Can you realistically commit to your goal? That's all it really comes down to. Can you realistically commit to whatever goal you have? You may need to reevaluate all these things this year. If you're looking to change your outcome, you must change your choices, your habits, and your actions. Your consistency in the following things must equal in order to actually get the outcome you desire. If you don't want to be 100%, you know, don't make 100% goals. If you just want to eat better, cool, you can do that consistently. You can try new recipes, you can eat out less, that's fine. But don't have a goal to be a fitness model. If all you can consistently do is go grocery shopping. If your goal is to be ripped and jacked and super strong, okay, can you consistently meal prep? Can you consistently track your macros? Can you consistently follow a meal plan? Can you consistently go to the gym? If your actions, choices, and habits are anchored in reality, you can achieve anything. But what is your reality? Do you have multiple hours every day to spend on something? Maybe you do, maybe you don't. That should be a factor in what your goal is. That's all I'm saying for the new year.